Hello happy people, I'm back with another video and today I wanted to bring you all a review of two Bath & Body Works products um, and kind of compare them to see if they might be dupes for one another. Um, so the two products I'm going to be comparing today is the Coconut Mint Drop, which is definitely one of my all-time favorite winter scents. And I'm also going to be comparing the new um, item that was released in the Holiday Traditions 2019 edition, which is the Christmas Cocoa and Mint. So the well, first one I'm going to do is just put on some of the Christmas Cocoa and Mint because I'm very familiar with Coconut Mint Drop. And so primarily I'm going to be focusing on this Christmas Cocoa and Mint to see if it might be a good dupe for my beloved coconut mint drop so as i'm putting it on right now i'm getting some really good vibes i'm getting an andy's thin mint i'm getting girl scout thin mint cookie vibes okay so first i'm going to talk about my beloved coconut mint drop here's the packaging right here it's really cute i believe this came out in 2017 if i'm not mistaken um and so it's with super smooth it's a super smooth body lotion with shea butter. The scent notes on here is white coconut, iced peppermint, and winter musk. This scent is just an absolutely lovely scent. Um, so what I get when I smell it is, I get, like I said, it's a nice, um, I get a nice fresh peppermint scent that has that hint of musk at the end. But overall, it smells like a really nice, complete chocolatey mint scent. And maybe because the mint is so, it's so, it's like a muted type mint. And I really feel like that must kind of makes it more of like a, like a not overbearing, super uh, peppermint, super minty scent. Um, and I think that the coconut also helps to subdue some of the mint scent in it. It's just a nice overall round scent. So yeah, I really enjoy this scent a lot. And so um, Bath & Body Works, unfortunately, they did discontinue this scent. I was looking for it high and low during the winter semi-annual sale and they did not bring it back. They did bring it back in like the hand soap form, but I really wanted some more body care, in particular the body wash. And I would have loved to snag up another lotion. Um, but unfortunately, they don't have it anymore. So once I go through this, this will be my <laughs> last experience with my beloved coconut mint drop so I'm just kind of enjoying every little bit of it that I have right now and with that being said I've been looking for a dupe and so I've been comparing it and want to kind of do a comparison to see if I might have a dupe for it and so this is where the Christmas cocoa and mint came into place um, I did just put some of this on my hand and I'm gonna read you the scent notes on this one It's decadent milk chocolate thin mint cookies and marshmallow fluff it says that this has cocoa butter, shea butter, and aloe in it. I will say, this is a really lovely scent too. It's a very chocolatey scent. When I smell it, it definitely just puts me in the mind of Andy's Mints. That's the biggest scent I get off of it. And so, with that being said, it's really not a direct dupe for the Coconut Mint Drop because the Coconut Mint Drop has a more... I don't know, just a subdue, kind of like a mature peppermint scent, if that even makes sense. More of a, like a, I don't know, it's just like more of a well-rounded peppermint scent. I think the coconut and the musk in it really helps to subdue the peppermintness, the mint, the mintness to it. And then I think for the Christmas cocoa and mint, it really does smells like, essentially like, yeah, like a Thin Mint cookie or an Andy's Mint, right? Or even a York Peppermint Patty. Like, I really get more of like a candy-like mint, a chocolate mint scent to it. Um, and with this one, is more of, of a subdued scent. And so, while the scents definitely are not direct dupes from one another, I will say that this is a pretty close um, scent that still puts me in the mind of Coconut Mint Drop. And so, I'm definitely happy to have it in my collection. I actually bought this and I got a couple of backups of it because um, I don't want what happened to Coconut Mint Drop to happen to this scent and yeah it's really nice I think I'm gonna really enjoy it like I said it's a little bit more chocolatey and it's a little bit more chocolatey of a scent than I would like um but I do like that hint of mint to it that kind of brings me back to the coconut mint vibes and so yeah if you all are looking for something that's somewhat similar to coconut mint drop definitely not an absolute dupe 
um, Christmas cocoa and mint would be a nice number two option for you. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this review of me comparing these two items. Um, I know a lot of people, I know at least for me when I was looking to purchase this item, I was wanting to see a review where people kind of compared the two to see if it's a dupe. Um, sadly to say it's not a dupe, but it is a pretty close second for coconut mint drop. It's a nice substitute is what I'll say. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this review. Um, let me know your thoughts on coconut mint drop if you've tried it and then also your thoughts on Christmas cocoa and mint. They're both very lovely scents. Um, if you like mint or if you like chocolate mint or anything like that, you'll love either one of those two scents. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Saturdays in particular, I do focus on my bath and body work videos. And so if you all are coming for bath and body work fixes, definitely tune in every single Saturday. Um, and feel free to join the Big Happy family. I would love to have you all be a part of it. And as always, leave some love in the comments down below. And I'll see you in my next video. I hope you have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.